uh, if in the future this I get I get like famous and uh, like this video blows up and it with a lot of other videos like this get it taken down then I apologize. Anyway, welcome to Project Roaring Aurora. Project, uh, yeah, so this is Project Roaring Aurora. Uh, for those of you who don't know, this is basically just Pokemon Brick Bronze. Now, for those of you who don't know what Project Brick Bronze is, let me tell you all a story. So, long ago, on Roblox, there was a game called Pokemon Brick Bronze. And it was a fan-made Pokemon game. And, and it was beloved by the community, both Pokemon and Roblox. However, one day, in, like, fucking 2015, I don't, I don't remember, uh, they went on, po Nintendo and the Pokemon company went on a murdering spree, taking down tons of fan-made projects, and, it, like, picks, like, uh, Blockmon, or whatever the fuck it's called, I, I don't remember what it was called. And much like, and much like this game, and much like the Pokemon Minecraft mod, this game was taken down too. And I was there for that event. I was very sad. But then after that happened, the people that made the game decided they would combat this with their very own, with Lumion Legacy. The Pokemon Brick Bronze being taken down is the reason that that game exists. It is a parody of Pokemon, of a Pokemon game, made by the original developers of Brick Bronze, and then silence for many, many years, until one day, the, uh, a group of people that were dedicated fans of the original game decided that they would step up and create Project Roaring Rora, or as more commonly known by all the bootleg games. Project Brick Bron Project uh, Bronze Forever. They're probably calling it Project Roaring Rora as a cover up for the actual, uh, like so that way, this like doesn't get it taken. So that way it doesn't get taken down again. And uh, then a couple months ago, I was browsing the Roblox page and saw a project a not official this not this one but a different. Uh, Project Bonds Forever, and I, that was basically an exact reconstruction of this, except uh, they had Sprigatito, and I have not been able to find that game, because I do have a save on there. But yeah, and uh, now we're here, I played it a bit. And now, you see, there is a problem here, because this is the first gym. It is an electric-type gym. And I have things that are weak to electric. I have a, the only things that I have on my team... Or a level 9 Shinx, a level 9 Rookie D, a level 15 Oshawa, and a level 7 Eevee that you get that I got from joining the group. And if you don't know, ground electric types' only weaknesses are ground types. So, in a sense, I am basically fucked. Now, what I'm going to do is level up Oshawa and into d -Watt because I only need one more level to do that, and then we will go from there. See what happens. And while we're doing that, I guess I'll just, I don't know, talk, because I don't know what to do. Like I said, I don't do... Commentaries, or maybe I'll just, you know, won't talk at all, and uh, it'll be an epic montage. I will add my own music in later, but I'm turning this up so that way uh, I don't start getting scared because of the silence. I've been watching horror content, which is why I would be scared.
What? Why aren't you evolving? Hold on, I'm gonna go to the Pokemon Center to heal my Pokemon and then see what the hell is going on. So, like, I don't know if I'm doing something wrong or whatnot, but, uh, my damn otter thing doesn't want to evolve. So, uh, hopefully that doesn't become an issue and we're just gonna go to the gym. The people don't speak fucking gibberish here. Oh, I have to do the puzzle all over again? Are you kidding me? Fuck. I don't remember. Oh, I did this. Especially if you have a water type starter. Shad. What a dickhead. And I forgot what level his Pokemon are. That's not good. No siree. thing keeps on charging. And I don't know what charge does, but I don't think that's very good. Okay, well that almost killed me. And that did kill me. So let's send in our own Shinx. Let's see what happens. If I remember correctly, this dude's second Pokemon is like an Electric. That's nice, too bad it's about to not apply because this dude has a Pikachu. I never made it past the... Oh, and... oh, okay. I never made it past the Shanks, apparently. That was a crit, damn. Anyway, uh, time to get absolutely obliterated. A couple weeks ago, there was a glitch where, like, the battle UI was just not on the screen. Glad they fixed that, though. Because I really enjoy this game. It's nostalgic. Despite the fact of me using a, uh, a Rook D. Also, we're not trying to do super effective damage. We're just trying to whittle this thing down so that way Oshawott can uh, come in here and hopefully water gun it to death. Just a classic case of overleveled starter syndrome. Thank you, Rookie D, despite being paralyzed. And uh, that move, that turn did not count. Rookie B is about to be charged beam to hell and back. Never mind. Oh. Alright, well, damn.
Nice. And the people here are still speaking Spanish. Yes, I know what... I know what they do, guy. Uh, I'm gonna teach my shanks. Charge beam. As I can. Nobody cares when you shut the fuck up. Uh, I have nothing. Maybe you shouldn't say that while I'm recording, Anubis. You ever think about that, dumbass? Oh yeah, new podcast tomorrow. Hopefully, at least. I don't know. I had trouble producing the last vlog. I had to delete a bunch of shit off my phone to re-download it and then re-download it so that way I could actually make the vlog on the jerry can. Speaking of the jerry can, I do not know if we will do anything with the jerry can tomorrow, because usually with the podcast, there is a corresponding, corresponding jerry can video. I do not want to go back to the Pokemon Center. Uh, I'm gonna go and try level up, leveling up Oshawott again, and then I will cut back so that way this video is easier to produce for, because of the reasons I just mentioned. Fellas, we've hit another roadblock. I taught my Oshawa cut, and nothing. There's nothing that I can do. I cannot do anything. Oh, there we go. Thank you. Okay, so Oshawa evolved. And the Dewat, finally. So, I'm going to do a bit more grinding, and I will cut back to this later when Shinx has evolved. Hey, so I've decided that I'm going to end the video here because, uh, I am lazy. And do not want to uh, continue because I am bored. Yeah, I'm very lazy. But, uh, yeah. Uh, I will be making more content on this game. Be because I can. It's all I can really do right now. I, I rearrange moves. I remember doing it earlier. Anyway, yeah, bye. Funny fucking story time. I made it all the way through to the fucking area. I got a lot of progress on my Pokemon, and I got soft locked, and now everything is back to where it was. I got Rookadi and Eevee some levels, but they all died. And then I got soft locked and lost all my progress. I also had Dewat up to fucking. Level 22, so now I have to run all the way back through there, fight all those trainers again, and then I'm gonna have to come back here just to make just to make it to the damn city, and then I'm gonna have to fight all these trainers back and forth, so that way I can get my Pokemon back up to standards. This is some bullshit. I'm very mad about this. You want to know how I got so locked? The text that Nurse Joy had popped up a bit too late, and it wouldn't let me move on. It wouldn't let me close the text box, and you can't do anything with the text box. Isn't 
if a text box is open, like you can't move. So I effectively got soft locked. <laughs> So I have to do all that again. Taking you with me this time though. I'm also gonna do the method that I do in every other Pokemon game. That doesn't have any XP share, which is switch in, switch out. Now I went up there, but you have to go through here. that five means but I think it means like number of Pokemon that we've identified or some shit like that And if you refuse to do so, I will just evolve you into a Jolteon. Also, funky text glitch. I'm gonna switch into Shang, so I'm not gonna switch out to you on here. I feel like Shang should be able to handle this. Never mind. See, I feel like it should be super effective against the poison. Let's just 
power trip do? Not very effective on the bird, dumbass. I see nothing. Hey, Jazz. It's my move. Fuck you. Original cover Pokemon was Hoopa. Was Hoopa important to this game? Do we use the bronze brick to summon them? Is that what this all has to do with each other? Alright, now this time I'm going to save. So that way... If Nurse Joy's text decides to not pop up again. Okay, this time it worked. Now, I'm going to go make this video. That has been all, and I will see you all next time.